It's another common misconception. Why does Michael Novogratz hate Cardano? I don't think he hates Cardano. I don't think he hates anything in this space. Guy is uh, talking its book. You know, when you're a billionaire and you've made bets, bet, 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 you're going to talk your book and you're going to do those bets and uh, things are outside your scope. You know, that is what it is. You know, if he had bought ADA, he'd be saying we're the greatest thing ever. You know, 20, he, I talked to 20 brilliant people. And they all tell me Cardano is the best thing ever. So people talk their book. So uh, it tells you a lot who criticizes you. Look at the criticism Bitcoin is getting right now. You know, Hillary Clinton is coming out. And all these swamp creatures are coming out. And they're, Bitcoin is bad. It's destabilizing the U.S. economy. It's this terrible thing. <gasps> the people who love the legacy system and control and are creatures of the swamp are saying cryptocurrencies are a threat? Why? Because you get to be your own bank? You get an inflationary monetary instead of an inflationary monetary policy? You don't get to print 40% of all the money in circulation in the last 18 months? Huh. You see, so people talk their book. The political class has a book. The banking class has a book. The VC class has a book, the, and so forth. And, you know, it is uh, it is what it is. And so don't, don't put undue emotions or feelings in, these, in this respect. Things change. In 24, 36 months, if we pull off all the stuff we say we're going to pull off, You'll probably be our biggest fan and say, oh, well, you know, that was the past, <laughs> you know, and you welcome them with open arms because uh, they're mercenaries in that respect.